Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're taking a look at BattleBox Mission 93 with a bunch of cool bushcraft and outdoor gear inside. Let's check it out. Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're taking a look at the BattleBox Mission 93. This one is a really neat little kit inside here. Um, you could practically build yourself a starter bushcraft kind of kit to go out in the woods and practice your skills with from what's inside here. So today we're going to take a look at it. This is the basic box we're going to start out with. Now this has all the levels in it, of course, because I'm displaying it for you. But I'm going to show you what comes in each level and you can buy into each level monthly and get the gear that's in that one. As you buy successive better ones, you will also get the gear in the basic box. Then you get the gear in the advanced box and so on. So if you end up buying the Pro Plus box, you get all the gear that I'm going to show you today. So. Let me show you, this is basically a subscription service. You pay a monthly fee and you get the stuff every month. Let me show you, let's open it up and start out with the basic box. Now the first thing in your basic box, if I can get this lid to stay where I want it to, there we go, is this Uber Leiden Hexa Fire Starter. Now I've already taken this out and tested it. We are gonna open it up and let you see what it's like. It's a very unique little thing. Now being able to set a fire uh, or start a fire is a skill that everybody should be proficient in. Having the right tools is equally important in this. Now I gotta say, I've never seen a ferrocerium rod uh, like this one. This is a hexagonal, you can show by the size there, fire, fire starter. And as you can tell, I've tested it a little bit. Now the weird thing about this is it's just so darn good. I mean, I can just slowly scrape this along here without even trying and get sparks. That's really impressive. I don't have to you know, sweep down on it. And I think it has something to do with the edges of the hexagon here. I also tried it along here, and you will get sparks. You just have to brush off the protective coating on there. So as you can see, it's throwing some big sparks everywhere. I want to make sure I don't set my box on fire. But as you can tell, it's a pretty neat little system. Now this also has six sides for greater control and efficiency, allowing more surface contact area. When you get more, it will give you more showers of sparks. A uh, really impressive little thing. I, I always wanted to try one of these out myself. And I never ended up buying one because I have so many ferro rods. So I'm kind of glad I got this one. And as you can tell, this thing just, I mean, if you get going on it without starting a fire on my table here, you can see how much sparks this puts out, how many sparks this puts out. So it's really, really an impressive little system. Nice little ferrocerium rod. You got a nice little leather lanyard and enough room here. I hate it when they put the lanyard like this close and you're like, oh, I can't get it all the way down. <laughs> so you got more than enough lanyard on here. Nice leather strap. Very, very nice little system. And the striker is actually a very sharp 90 degree edge there. It's almost got a little burr on the edge there. So we'll definitely let you strike anything you want. Very cool little system. All right, first item. That's the first item in the basic box. A little bit of info on it, okay? You have your full grain leather lanyard. The length of this is six inches and the weight is 4.2 ounces. Not light, but most ferro rods aren't. So let's move on to the next thing. Now the next thing's kind of buried in here, I think, and I've already used this one too. Oh no, it isn't, it's right on top. This is Axe Wax. Now this is a premium, all natural, 100% all natural, food safe wood finish. It's made from a paste wax. It's ideal for axe, knife handles, axe handles. Works really good for preventing rust on blades as well. Um, when we get into something else, I'll show you, I already coated something else with it. And I'll show you this really quick too. This is a SEMA knife and I coated the, uh, sheath with it so it comes a little darker but it's nice and protected so it's definitely a nice little uh, addition to your kit because it's food safe and food grade you can use this on cutting boards so your outdoor cutting boards will now be safe from contamination or mold or anything like that i've used this so far on a tool in there that a couple of blades i've tried it out a little bit it's really just some basic paste wax you can kind of see my fingerprints in there so i've already tried it out i'm really impressed with this so far I could see a bunch of uses for this, especially with carbon steel knives. Excellent way to protect your blade using this stuff, and you can use it. So basically what you're going to do is you're going to warm, you want to warm the item up a little bit, and then you're going to apply this, okay? And you're going to let it set for 15, 10 to 15 minutes, then dry it off with a rag, wipe it off of all the excess with a rag, and you're good to go, and it will work in its way into the leather and impregnate in and keep everything safe. All right, next thing. And this is why I love my medic. They have these specialized kits. This is a hiker medic kit, okay? This little guy here has everything you need for common hiking injuries. Now this is a basic skill level 
tool. So there's nothing super fancy in here that's gonna require you to learn how to use it. Most of the stuff in here, very basic first aid gear. They're definitely a favorite source for me for quality medical supplies for all the activities you can think of. Um, as you can see, I've done a bunch of reviews on their gear before. Love how they put together these kits. They're really well thought out. And it's really an all-in-one first aid solution for everything you need to handle most common hiking injuries, no matter how small or large. Inside the kit, you're gonna find two little tubes of lip balm, sunscreen packets, two sting relief packets, two Cocos drink mixes, so if you get dehydrated, you're good there, two four x four gauze pads, a whistle, a space blanket, triple antibiotic, you got 25 feet of paracord in here. Thought that was kind of cool. Four bandages, two bandages of the two by four and four bandages of the one by three inch, two burn gels, two ibuprofen, some diphenhydramine, two super skin blister tapes, those are really handy if you get blisters on your feet, okay? Two alcohol prep pads, some aqua tabs. That's nice too. You got your aqua tabs in there for water purification in an emergency. Now the height on this is 5.8 inches, about 6.1 inches. Depth is about 2.8 inches and the weight, weight on this is 6.4 ounces total. So it's not a super heavy kit and a pretty well-rounded, what I would call a boo-boo kit, you know, um, pretty well-rounded boo-boo slash emergency kit. So that is your basic box, okay? These three items down here come in your basic box. Now, we're gonna move up to the next level, okay? And that is the advanced box. And I'm gonna show you what's in that. All right, folks. Now, the next item is by the same people who gave us that ferro rod. And it is the Uberleden Stainless Stoker Flat Pack Stove. It comes in a waxed canvas sleeve here. All right. And while you're out in the great outdoors, a flat pack natural stove really makes sense. It's just so easy to carry. You don't need fuel. You don't need anything. You can gather up sticks and cook in this. I'll cook over a fire in it, and you have a controlled fire. You guys have seen me review these types of stoves before. Now, I will tell you something. When you get this, it's going to have some plastic coating on it. You're going to have to peel that coating off. It really wasn't all that bad. Um, there have been some things I've gotten that have been a nightmare to clean off. So basically, this is all going to just go together. Okay, It's all going to snap together in place like that. Actually, like that. Like that, all the way around, and you'll have yourself a little stove. Let me uh, turn up the camera for a sec, put this together for you, and show you what it looks like assembled. All right, so there you go. It's all put together. Very easy, very sturdy. I got to say, it's very, very sturdy. Um, very well-made stainless steel, so it's not super light. It's not titanium, but you get the idea. You can fill that with organic matter, trees, sticks, leaves, whatever, and have yourself a nice little fire to cook over in a controlled environment. You do have this nice waxed uh, canvas sleeve here. You can also use this as a tinder collection pouch if you wanted to while you got your stove set up You can go out collect your tinder collect your wood your sticks, whatever and you will be good to go So I really really like this thing. I love these little flat pack stoves. I just think they're awesome I think they're really easy to use now the height on this is 6.5 inches your base width is 5.5 inches across and your top width is 4.5 inches basically five step assembly you're just going to put these three sides together, stick that middle piece in there, and then put this on and twist that on the other way, and you're good to go. It's all put together really easy. The total weight on it is 15 ounces, so it's not going to be, you know, ultra, ultra lightweight, but it's definitely a cool little item. Let me pull it apart for you here, and you will definitely enjoy using it. Um, I love these little things because I just think they're so convenient. They're so easy to use. And put together, as you can tell, this thing isn't rattling apart or falling apart. Uber Leading usually makes very good good quality gear all right let's move on to the last item in there the second to last item i should say that's the advanced box we're moving on to the pro box which has something that's really cool and if you guys remember a while back this is something that was out of production for a really long time so let me get it out and show it to so you this is something that's been out of uh, production for many many years and it's only been available on a, at estate sales maybe a few here and there you find on ebay they're really, usually very very expensive and this is the MTM bonded Skatchet. This is a multi-tool of the woods. It's amazing this thing can do. It's a multi-purpose tool. It includes a skinner, hatchet, hammer, ripper, or a gut hook if you want. You can use this tool from the hand as an improvised knife for ulu. It's great for skinning game. Or you can make a handle from surrounding wood you may find wherever you are and use it as a hatchet or a hammer. It's very tough, very well constructed, made of 65 MN carbon steel, and it comes with this nice genuine leather sheath. I'm gonna give you a quick look at this thing because I can see myself using this. Um, it does come out of the sheath like that. And that's pretty much it. Now, if you wanna use it as a hammer, of course you can there, but you can also use this as an ulu if you're cutting or skinning. 
Okay, very sharp edge on it to start with. I gotta tell you that right now. That thing is really, really sharp. And as you can tell, I did use a little Axe Wax on this one, so it's a little bit darker than when it came. I can't find an original spot in here because I covered everything pretty well. But this is really nice too as well. Now you do get a screwdriver with a couple of screws in here, and you'll be like, what the heck is that for? Well, here's the idea. You find yourself a piece of wood out in the wild somewhere, a nice straight piece, and you stick it in here, and you can screw it in here, and then this can be used as a hatchet or as a knife. So very, very handy, very cool. I really like this thing. I had never heard of it up until now, and I had to actually do some research on it because I'm like, what the heck is this thing? And uh, I guess these were really, really hard to find and very well received by the bushcraft community when they first came out, and no one could find them after they stopped making them. So MTM Bonded is making these again, and you can pick one up in the battle box. Very cool, very impressive. I am going to play around with that one. That looks like a tool I'll enjoy using. Now, lastly, let's move into the last thing. I kind of want to move things out of the way here. You've probably seen me review many of these knives previously. This is the Holtzman's Gorilla Survival. We just did the little neck knife version of this, Bloodline. Okay, let me open it up and let us take a look and see what's inside. Now, if you guys have followed my channel, you know that Holstman's Gorilla Survival has been a really hot company over the last year with a multitude of awesome, affordable survival, survival knives. Now, as a lifetime outdoorsman, the owner of the company, Nate, found a lot of cheaper knives on Amazon and other places and was always disappointed with what he found. So he decided to go out and make his own, okay? And that's how Holstman's Gorilla Survival kind of got its start. Now, this knife here, okay, this is a premium 8.27 long survival knife. Extra sharp blade, very, very sharp blade, by the way. That was shaving hair last night when I tested it. Uh, they've made a high carbon steel, 1095 high carbon steel. It'll help you cut rope, open holes in wood, make kindling to start a fire, baton, whatever your survival needs are. And let me tell you something, this thing is heavy. It is built like a tank. Uh, you got your orange liners in there. And of course, it's a full tang knife. G10 scales on it. 1095 high carbon steel blade. You guys have seen me actually test this very knife in the channel when uh, I originally was testing some for Nate when it began. And you have your sheath here, which is a real Kydex sheath, not the fake plastic they try to sell you. You do have the tech lock on the back, so this just snaps on your belt. I am loving these kind of things. It's just so easy to stick on your belt. And when you're done, you just push it down, pop it off, and you're done. Sheath is very well fitted. You can just slide this right in here right in there and you have your little snap across the top so you have a retention device right there and if you want to move this around or use the smaller back or whatever you can moving the screws around so it's very easy to manipulate and move very very impressive knife really really nice looking knife you got g10 scales 1095 high carbon steel the blade length is four inches and the entire length of the whole knife is 8.27 so definitely worth checking out he makes some really nice looking affordable high quality knives i have you've seen in the channel how many i reviewed and i still have them all and i've yet to damage or break any of them they are really nicely well made nice looking little knives that is the last level there and that's the pro plus the pro was the mtm bonded scatchet so all in all i think we got some amazing gear here I'm really impressed with a lot of the stuff this month this is enough to get you started on a quality bushcraft kit if you wanted to start going out in the woods and working on your skills and learning some stuff you got a fire starter a way to cook a first aid kit even a little tinder bag if you're not uh, using that for the stove you got the scatchet which is pretty much a multi-use item uh, and i do like the fact we are going to try this one out i want to put a stick in there get a nice branch somewhere and put a stick in there it's hard here in the desert because there aren't trees out here you know there's like bushes and i do have a pine tree in my front yard but i can't just lop off a branch from that because they're too high up but uh, i'm going to definitely look around and find myself a nice stick to put in there of uh, some decent wood and we're going to try this out because i really like this i even like this just as a hand tool so definitely cool stuff anyway folks my link is down below if you're interested in getting started on this i do have a discount code for you it's iridium 24 Okay, that's just Iridium 24, not 242, just Iridium 24. And that will get you 15% off your brand new subscription or any item on the site. I do have a link down below as well, which will take you there. That's my personal portal, so I put stuff up there, you know, that I want you guys to see if you're interested in purchasing. So definitely check it out. They really have some good gear. They've really been stepping up their game as of late. Now, I know some people will look at this 
and just see the words battle box and come here and leave a comment like i could buy that stuff for five dollars okay you know what? <laughs> go ahead and try and then make a video and show me um i really think they've stepped up their game a whole lot and i really like the stuff and this is a battle box that i will keep everything from i will use everything in this entire box so definitely cool stuff anyway folks check the link down below don't forget to check it out i have my links for this one and my discount code below in the description below that we have our amazon affiliate store if you're interested in purchasing anything even if you don't see anything that you like just click the link and shop as you normally would really helps us out below that we have our freeze-dried wholesalers link now that link will save you 15 percent just for clicking it Okay, when you check out, you will see your discount at the end. At the end, when you purchase all your stuff, put it in your shopping cart, and you check out, before you enter your credit card information and shipping and all, you will see your discount right there, and you'll show you, you save 15% just for using my link. Below that is our My Patriot Supply link. Now, we've got some really good deals on there, okay? Uh, this month, we have $250 off of the three-month kit. Now, that kit was pretty affordable to begin with. Normally, three, four, five month kits are in the thousands of dollars. It started in the $800 range. You're going to save $250 on that this month. We also have the four week kit for $50 that's on sale. It's $50 off on sale. So definitely check that out. It's preparewithiridium.com, preparewithiridium.com, and our Thrive Life freeze dried food store, as well as our Jace Medical. If you guys are interested in getting some quality antibiotics prescribed to you from an American doctor, sent to you from the United States, not overseas, from some who knows where company, check them out. Good deal. Anyway, folks, thank you for watching. Stay safe and stay prepared.